Eric, I'll, I'll start off if you don't mind. Um, okay. One that we get a lot is how do I determine the proper shock length? What what criteria? How do we go about that? So uh, if you'll if you'll take it from there. Absolutely. Well, that's a, that's a popular question that we do get uh, when folks call into the AFCO uh, eight hundred number, and basically it's a it's a pretty straightforward process. You want what you want to do is you want to measure the distance between your two mounting points at ride height. So <clears throat> put the car on the ground, measure from the top bolt down to the bottom bolt, you'll get your number, let's say it's whatever it is, 14 inches for example. At that point, you can then look at online or in the AFCO catalog if you have one, and we've got a, a reference chart that would give you a suggested ride height and a range. And so you just want to pick the shock that fits uh, the range that matches what you just measured on your car. So for example, if it was a 14 inch uh, distance, uh, in most cases that's gonna require a five inch stroke shock. One of our most popular would be the 3850 Eliminator, Eliminator Series double adjustable shock. And that's pretty much all you gotta do. So you just one, measure the two mounting points uh, with the car sitting at ride height. And then just reference over to our catalog or online to our, our little reference chart. Sure. And if, if for that matter, if you need to make a phone call and or you'd like to make a phone call and talk to somebody, uh, happy to help there as well with that kind of a question. For more information, visit us at afcoracing.com.